okay. You've got a design in Figma or maybe somewhere else like Adobe XD and you want it built in Webflow. In this video, we're gonna walk through exactly how to do that. First, a quick myth. The Figma to Webflow app is not our app and it doesn't play nicely with Reloom or Client First. And we don't recommend working with this app when using Reloom. Okay, to kick off, the first thing I would recommend is scanning through every page of the design to get an idea of all of the components that are gonna be needed for this project. Flag anything you're not sure of. Next, set up your Webflow project by duplicating a copy of the Reloom Style Guide clonable adding your color variables and styles. If you haven't watched our videos on Webflow Style Guide and importing to Webflow, please watch these before continuing. Before importing, ensure you have installed the Reloom Chrome extension and that Class Sync is turned on. Quick pro tip, if the project is already in Reloom's Site Builder, import it. If it's not and you have to build from scratch into Webflow, I highly recommend creating all of the pages which are going to be in your Webflow project and adding your page structure to each page before importing anything at all. This also includes CMS pages. I'm telling you, this is a huge time saver. Once your Webflow project is set up and ready to import, you have two options. And for both of these options, I like to have Webflow and the Reloom library on one screen and Figma on the other. If your project used Reloom and you have the names of each component, perfect. Search, copy, paste. Repeat this step for each page until all of your components are pasted into the project. Done. If you don't have the names of the components, the process is simply going through each section by section and finding the closest component structurally that you can find in Reloom. Copying and pasting. I found on most projects, this process is normally under 30 minutes compared to hours or days of doing it manually. Not to mention it's perfectly synced with your style guide and client first naming conventions. Now you've moved your components into Webflow, our next step is to simply Webflow. Make the final tweaks and match the design. For more information on working with FinSuite's client first, please look at their incredible documentation and check out our resources for more videos on how to get the most out of Reloom.